Welcome to another FL Studio for Beginners tutorial video. In this video I'll be going over how to record all external input as in microphones, guitars, any instrument that you can plug in and record externally. Any external instrument. So right now I have my audio interface connected USB to my PC. It has a one and two input connection an XLR connection or a one quarter inch cable connector. You can use RCAs as well. You just have to have the adapter to go on the end of the RCAs to make it the one quarter inch connection. My audio interface is a Presonus audio box USB 96. Once you have your microphone or instrument like a guitar plugged into your audio interface. You would want to pull up your mixer track, your mixer page, choose a channel that you would like to record in, go right here to the top of your effects and click whichever connection your external input is going to be coming through. So I have mine in one. Yes, I want to record all external input only. So now it's recording my voice. It's going to record my speakers when because I have my speakers playing so it's double recording basically you have to have this recording button on for it to register for it to pick up I'm going to add a limiter so it doesn't clip I'm gonna compress it a little bit make it louder check check alright so one way to record into your FL project is to open up Edison in the effects. Edison is the audio editor. So this is a very powerful stock plugin inside of FL Studio. When you have a singer or a rapper recording and they have headphones in, whatever equipment y'all are using, they're gonna hear themselves speak back or sing back into the headphones when you're recording like this, they're gonna hear their own voice and that's definitely gonna mess them up. So this little speaker icon right here next to the Edison name is how you cancel that feedback. So I'm still recording, it's still picking up sound, but you just can't hear the feedback so they can record without them talking to themselves and it messing them up. That's one big powerful tip to help with recording using Edison you just hit this recording button and once input starts coming in it starts recording so you have your WAV file right here you can do a lot of things to it you can select whatever and delete you can I'll make another video for Edison separately but you can do a lot of things to edit this WAV file specifically if this button right here is to click and drag it onto your project so now you have your recording in your project and then you can just route that to a different mixer track and start from there um, you can go right here and cut this out record a new one um, you can choose if you want it to record as soon as you hit the button or if you want to record on input or on play Edison is something that I use almost in every single track Another way to record a WAV file into the arrangement is to hit this recording button up here at the top. You can record audio into Edison, which I just showed you. You can record audio into the playlist as an audio clip. That's what I'm about to do. You can record notes and MIDI. You can record absolutely everything. So I'm gonna hit audio into the playlist as an audio clip. So now I have a recording track in my arrangement. I have the option to choose my in it one or in it two for my external input. I'm gonna click one, it's gonna count me down, and now I'm recording in straight into my arrangement. And so now I have that WAV file. So you can just click and drag that off. You can hit record again, arm to record again. And now you gotta hit this record button at the top, audio into the playlist, and boom, I'm recording again. This is how you record directly into the arrangement. This is your in it one and it two external input source this is your external input only where you're recording from 
this is the arm to disarm recording and then you have the microphone here and recording track just to tell you that it's your recording track those are two ways to record audio or all external input into FL Studio. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe.